But before we go to that main event, let's get into some amateur kickboxing now. From West Mesa High School, here on the 8 Count Boxing Hour, it's amateur kickboxing. Let's go to that footage. the 13th bout of the night we have Ruben Gonzalez representing Rosales kickboxing he's making his debut tonight in the with the blue trunks fighting out of the blue corner his opponent Angel Marez with a record of 4 and 0 Angel is undefeated representing Harding kickboxing Ruben Gonzalez in the blue coming in at 125 pounds Marez at 120 and you see Gonzalez moving forward and now being moved back by Angel Marez and unlike our last bout, this is not a technical uh, chess match. These guys are fighting. Yes, they are. They're getting out there and they're and pretty much brawling. I think, I think that Ruben Gonzalez is going to have to get out of that, off, the, off the ropes and get out there and start and fighting more instead of backing up, though. So. Angel Marez in the black trunks is undefeated at 4 0. So uh, I think Ruben Gonzalez has picked a hard way to start his kickboxing career. Yes, he has. Very hard. It's very hard to get out and try and beat somebody with a 4-0 record. Now you see, uh, looks like Mata's left arm was kind of held up there, but he continued to bang away with a free hand. And there's a good right hand. Well, a little right hand. You can see Mata's actually looking for a target, and uh, uh, Gonzalez was just kind of standing there being the target. Yes, he is. He's standing there, and he keeps looking at that leg, and he shows he's going through the leg kick. If, uh, if Ruben gets out there and he sees that leg kick coming, he had to check more instead of taking the leg kick. Okay, so Angel Marez now working his opponent over in the corner. There's a good kicks and punches. Ruben Gonzalez definitely should not be there. No, I don't think he should be in the corner either. He needs to get out and move around more. Again, Marez working his man in the corner with both hands. Ruben Gonzalez gets out, but he's he's starting to look a little soft. I think those punches are starting to take a toll on him. Yes, I think they are too. Uh, <clears throat> Marez has been running some really good shots on him. There's the bell to end the first round. A good match underway here. So here we go with the second round of this bout scheduled for three. Ruben Gonzalez in the blue trunks. Angel Meraz, Marez in the black trunks. And now we're getting wild here. Ruben Gonzalez now starting to attack. There's a little leg kick. Now Angel Marez fighting his way out. Both men exchanging here. I don't know who these, they're still at it. Back fists are flying everywhere now. And a left hand from Marez. Charles came out good in the, in the first part of the second round. He came out real good and real strong. He said he can hold it up and keep it up. Again, both men exchanging now. They're tying up a little bit. They come out and burn a lot of fuel to open that second round. Referee Johnny Gonzalez tells him, breaks him up and starts him up again. Here comes Angel Marez now on the attack. Ruben Gonzalez back in the corner. What was the warning for? I didn't, I didn't notice what the warning was for. I didn't see anything that was done wrong. Here comes Angel Marez now again. Ruben Gonzalez on the ropes and Angel Marez taking advantage of it. Again, driving Gonzalez back into the ropes. Angel, 
body shot there is sitting back there. Now he's coming back to the head again. Again, a good right hand to the head. Angel Mata is taking control of this fight. Even Gonzalez needs to do something here. Might be running out of gas. There's a good leg kick, and I think Angel Mata is starting to chip away at uh, Ruben Gonzalez. Yes, he is. Those leg kicks are starting to take effect on him. You can tell because uh, Gonzalez is not checking the leg kicks. He needs to check more on them leg kicks. Again, Mata is still throwing his hands. Maybe not as sharply as he was, but he's still throwing. And Gonzalez going back to the ropes. Back in the corner again. Now he's, he's driven from one corner to the other. Angel Mata is really uh, bullying his, his opponent around the ring. Third round is underway. Referee makes some touch gloves. And here we go. Oh, immediately. Angel Mata has landed a little shot. And now uh, Ruben Gonzalez retaliates with an elbow and gets a warning. Angel Mata is trying to land a kick. Comes up a little bit short. Both men tie up. Now Mata lands a good shot. Right hand. has been controlling this this bout and uh Ruben Gonzalez slipped out, of slipped out of the ring off the edge of the mat well you can really get hurt yes you can get really get hurt slipping out like that it's best to stay off the ropes if you can you stay out in the middle of the ring and fight right that's right and he goes back into the ropes now he turns the tables on Mares Ruben Gonzalez going to work on Mares in the corner and Angel Mares now comes out of the corner both men in fighting now and Ruben Gonzalez fighting in spurts. Now he's backing up again to the ropes. He's been spending a lot of time retreating, and that definitely has to hurt him in the eyes of the judges. Yes, it does. It hurts him a lot in the eyes of the judges. As he keeps retreating, he's not firing back. And now Angel Marduk has Ruben Gonzalez pinned in the corner again. Referee Johnny Gonzalez breaks him. Gonzalez tries to land a sneak right hand. Catching out, Marez coming in. There's a good little body shot by Marez, and he's keeping his hands moving. That's got to be helping him with the scoring. Yes, I think it is. It's helping him quite a bit because he keeps his hands moving. He's catching with some pretty decent shots. Both of them are getting pretty tired in this last round, but they're still landing with decent shots. And now Marez continuing to land more shots. And I think he's really pulling ahead in this bout. Or he was ahead, and I think he's... I think that ends the, the fight, and I think uh, Angel Matas uh, should get the decision on this one. I think, I think Angel Matas should get the decision on that. He stayed much more active in this whole round. All the way through the fight, he kept the other fighter up against the ropes, and uh, he stayed uh, the aggressor. Good match between these two featherweights, and we're going to get the decision now on this bout that went the full three rounds. Angel Marez representing Harding Kickboxing, and Ruben Gonzalez in his debut representing Rosales Kickboxing. And I think Ed Chavez has the judges' totals, and he's about to let us know who the winner is in this bout. Pulls out the victory, and he now runs his record to 5-0. and oh. He's a pretty good-looking little kickboxer. Yes, he is. He's got quite a bit of talent behind him. Good match.